is uh, 502 now. New this morning, can some this fire assessing uh, Elk Grove home this morning uh, that was uh, damaged in an early morning crash. Now the wreck did cause gas leak and that forced firefighters to evacuate some neighbors near Blossom Ridge and McLean Drives this morning. Case here three's Brian Hickey is joining us now at that house with an update. Good morning. Yeah, what I've learned from Elk Grove police is that the driver fell asleep at the wheel and continued down McLean and ran straight up into that house. You can see here behind me, you can see the damage where he went right over a cable box and then into the corner of the home where unfortunately that's also where the gas meter is located and the driver took out that gas meter around 115 this morning and uh, that sparked a gas leak out here which ultimately led to the evacuation of five homes in every direction so about 20 homes evacuated here this morning as the fire department and PG&E tried to figure out how to stop the gas leak the problem was the vehicle was on top of the pipe that broke they couldn't get they couldn't pull the vehicle off of the pipe because it was leaking gas they didn't want to spark anything so then they had to use a shovel to dig down under the car to clamp the pipe and then eventually drag that vehicle off of the pipe. So all of that work is done now. Looks like PG&E will come back later today to make the final repairs to the gas meter that is now gone. In the meantime, neighbors say the smell of gas was pretty thick out here this morning. A firefighter came up to our house and then rang our doorbell and told us to leave. And you yeah, get out, huh? Yeah. Get out because there's a gas leak. As soon as they opened the door, you can smell it was pretty strong. Considering it was like two, three houses down, it was pretty strong. Yeah, the police department went on to say that the driver had no sign of drugs or alcohol or anything like that. He told them that he'd worked a double shift and fell asleep at the wheel and unfortunately went right to the stop sign and up into that house over there. He had no injuries, but significant damage to his car and clearly major damage to the home behind me here in Elk Grove. I'm Brian Hickey, KCRA 3 News.